So if you have a chronic condition that you're struggling with, then you want to pay attention today. So today's topic is restorative longevity, the perfect solution for chronic conditions. I'm going to share with you the one way to find the perfect solution for you. Now, the perfect solution for you may not may be perfect for you, but not, may not be perfect for someone else. And that's why I'm going to help you discern that, distinguish. How do you find that? Because there's so much information out there, right? There's so much research. New research is getting done every single time. Physicians are, are relying upon this research. And then you have holistic practitioners, um, alternative practitioners, who are saying something different and it's like they're so confusing like who do i listen to who do i believe right and so here at least in the western culture we are trained to rely upon research research again just very quick <clears throat> i am a trained biochemist so i've done the research i've done research before and so uh, i completely love research i believe in research but I also know the truth. The truth is research can be manipulated. Research is accurate. The, the results of the research can be deceiving, right? Because it can be manipulated. Um, so, but I've talked about that in previous podcasts. So today I'm just going to focus on the perfect solution for chronic conditions. So let's jump right in. So the perfect solution for chronic conditions. Now the first question you need to ask yourself, right? Um, it's not what research and, who, and and really it's not who do you look for? Who do you ask? Which physician, which practitioner do you go to? That's not the first question, right? Because that could, if you ask, if you don't ask this first question, you could be led astray. Um, not, that, not that anybody's wrong, but you could be led astray to getting to someone who may not be the person who can give you the solution that you want. Okay, so not every uh, practitioner can give you the exact, uh, not every practitioner can give, you, can give you the exact solution that you want. So this is how to figure out, how do I find the perfect solution for me? First question you need to ask yourself, what solution are you looking for? This may seem like a simple and stupid question, but it is vital because if you ask the wrong person, you're going to get the wrong result for you. It may be right for someone else, but it's wrong for you. Okay. So you have to ask the right question first in order to find the right person to ask more questions. Right. So let me draw. You need to first ask the right question and that will lead you to the right people to talk to, which will then give you the right treatment options. For you again these are all customized what's good for you is not good for someone else okay so i'm not saying anybody's right or wrong i'm talking about you what's going to be right for you so let's come back to here the right question you should be asking is what solution are you looking for and i broke them down to two main categories right category one is temporary solutions so what solution are you looking for are you looking for something that's temporary right or are you looking for something that's long lasting? And what does that mean? The results. Are you looking for results that are temporary? And are you looking for results that are long lasting? Now you may think, man, that's a stupid question. Everybody wants long lasting results, right? Actually, no. I would say probably 90% of the world population does not want long lasting results. But actually maybe here in the Western culture. Well, let's do the 80-20 rule. 80%. 80% of the population here in the U.S. do not want long-lasting results. And how, how, how can I make that statement? Because what do people reach for? Medications and surgery. Those are all temporary results. They're not long-lasting results. For chronic conditions. I'm not talking about if you get in a car accident, you know, if you get shot, if you cut yourself. If, I'm not talking about emergency situations. That's why. Right. Today's discussion is about okay, chronic conditions, metabolic disorders, diabetes, high cholesterol, hypertension, neurodegenerative disorders, Alzheimer's, right? central tremors, neuropathy, 
chronic neurodegenerative disorders. These are the conditions I'm talking about. So let's just make sure we understand we're on the same page. So going back to 80% of the population here in the U.S. want temporary results. Why? And, and this will make sense as I go through uh, the more details of that. But 80% of the U.S. wants temporary results. So that's what I'm saying. It, it's not 80% of population, 20% population. Are there people that do both? Yeah, absolutely. Right. But they're... Regardless if you do both, but you're more, I would say, you're more leading towards one side, that's where I'm getting the 80-20 rule, okay? 80-20 rule is the Pareto, Pareto principle. Um, so what solution are you looking for? Are you looking for temporary results or long-lasting results? Temporary, let's go down through the, what's the difference? Temporary results are typically complex. They're complex. The result is complex, right? And long-lasting results, the the the, the, the uh, not the results are complex the way the treatment methods the therapies they're complex the for long lasting results the treatments the therapies the action steps you take are actually very simple let me give you an example what is complex temporary results so you have diabetes temporary results you inject insulin why is that complex because a pharmaceutical company had to do the research they had to do tests on rats and then I don't know, I don't know if they even do it on people let's say they do it on people they do it on animals they had to do it through all these years like 10 years of of R&D research and development that is complex right but simple what's a simple solution for diabetes right Reg balance your not sorry balance regulate your diet decrease foods stop eating foods that cause insulin surges, right? That's just changing your diet. So how simple? Changing your diet. Complex, you have to wait for a pharmaceutical company to develop a medication like metformin, you know, all these other medications for diabetics. You have to wait for someone to develop. It takes 10 years, that's complex. Remember, I'm a biochemist, right? Those research studies, right? Those tests that they do, they're complex. They're not simple. All right. All right. Next. Easy. Well, wow. okay. make sure delete results. So the solutions, if you want temporary, again, this is temporary. You want temporary. This color that works. Okay. If you want temporary results, then the solution, the treatments, the solution are easy. Why? Because it's a pill. Diabetes. What do you, when you go to your physician, you go to your endocrinologist, right what do they give you what's their solution it's always a pill it's a medication so it's easy for you to take all you have to do you don't have to change anything i remember uh when i first started practicing and uh as I, i'm an acupuncturist when i first and chinese med when i first started practicing i remember i had this patient that she was diabetic and she uh a1c was probably above around 10 or 11 which is super high she was injecting I think it was after just two years, she was starting injecting 10 units of insulin. And so this is what her physician, her endocrinologist told her. Her endocrinologist told this patient that I treated, personally treated, uh, you know what? You don't need to change your diet. All you have to do is inject insulin. If you inject insulin, then you can eat whatever you want because the insulin will bring your blood sugar down and it will control it. You just need to inject insulin and take these medications. That's what an endocrinologist 10 years ago, I'm probably 15 years ago, told this patient. And every year she started off with one unit of insulin, right? And then by the second year, she was already 10 units of insulin, right? So it's easy. All she had to do was inject insulin to herself and take a pill. It's easy, right? So if you're looking for temporary, but here's the thing, why it is temporary. Because when you inject insulin, it drops it only that for that day. The next day you got to do it again. Next day, you gotta do it again. You gotta take that pill for the rest of your life. She will have to, she if she did not come to me, she would have to have injected insulin for the rest of her life and taken medication for her diabetes for the rest of her life. After she came to our clinic and she had been in greater health, she is no longer diabetic. No pills, no injections, right? And that's the difficult part. Some of you may be asking, so she wanted, she came to our clinic because she wanted, she asked that question, she asked this question up here. What solution is she looking for? What solution am I looking for? She wanted a long lasting result. 
long lasting permanent solution, right? Long lasting result. So, I, but the therapy, the treatments are difficult. Why are they difficult? Because she had to change her diet. She had to change her lifestyle. She had to change her stress management. She had to change her sleep pattern. It's diff difficult. Those are simple, but they're difficult, right? Because they require a lot of discipline. That's the reason why it's so difficult. Next thing, when you choose temporary results, clear up this. When you choose temporary results, you become dependent. And this is the reason you, you're dependent. Like this, my, this patient that I treated who has diabetes, if she did not come to our clinic, she would be dependent upon injections. And each year she would inject more and more and more insulin. And then she would inject two, she would have to inject two insulin, long acting, right? If she continued on that process, she, instead of taking one pill, metformin, she would have ended up taking five pills. Because I've treated p patients who have, been, who, who have been injecting 50 units of insulin, five, zero, 50 units of insulin and on five diabetes medications. You are dependent. You are a slave to the pharmaceutical company for the rest of your life. Yes, you get to eat whatever you want, but you are a slave to pharmaceutical companies. Right. And so, and you're, you actually are going to die sooner than later. This is what they don't tell you, right? Injecting yourself full of insulin, it increases your aging process. You get older, faster. You get, you get decrepit, you get weak, faster. You get pain faster. You go to the grave faster. This is what they don't tell you, right? So that is the result. When you choose, when you say, Hey, I want a temporary solution. I want something that's, you know, easy and easy for me to do. I don't need to change. I don't need to have any discipline and I don't care if it doesn't last. If I can just take a pill, well, you're going to be dependent upon that someone else for the rest of your life. Right? Now, again, I'm not telling, I'm not saying this is right or wrong. So I, I, I want to apologize if, if I'm appearing that way. I'm not saying this is right or wrong. I'm just saying what you, you need to choose what solution you want. Now, if you choose a long lasting solution, guess what? You're going to have independence. You will not be dependent upon other people because when you choose a long lasting uh, solution, you're going to be able to restore your organ function. You're going to be able to restore your body's ability, your body's God given ability to heal itself. Right. Think about it. Most of us, we were born as babies. We were born. We did not require five to 10 medications to live. Right. Most of us. I know there's some babies that have problems when they, when they're, when they're born, but the majority of the population, we were born healthy. We did not, the, the uh, doctor didn't say in the hospital, Oh, this kid, you, when you were born, you need to take t these 10 medications just to stay alive. No, we were, Every baby that is born is a miracle. Why? Because God programmed our bodies, gave us something inside our body that allows us to self heal. That when we get a cut, we get an infection, we can heal it. We have an immune system, right? All we have to do is restore that, that ability to heal, our body's ability to heal itself, right? Once you do that, you will be independent. You will not, you know, you will not have to depend upon pharmaceutical companies, right? And last point, when you choose a short, term temporary results you're gonna get side effects just like the 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 uh the patient that i was talking about and um they didn't tell her about the side effects the more in insulin she injected the more weight she gained she gained 50 pounds in two years right and so they don't tell you about these side effects and she had more joint pain she would sure her mental acuity she couldn't think clear she had brain fog her joints were hurting she was getting, gaining weight, more pain, more sluggishness. Yes, her blood sugar was controlled by the medication and the injections, but everything else in her life, her quality of life, severely decreased. Those are the side effects. Now, if you're okay with those side effects, then hey, more power to you. But let's say you're not okay with side effects, right? Then when you choose a long lasting result, if you want long lasting results, you won't get the, you won't get side effects. I like to say you get side benefits because as a result for this diabetic patient that, that I'm using as an example, she came to our clinic. We helped her. We, we provided the tools, the education, the information to help her, right? Uh, to, to regain her body's ability to heal itself, but also at the same time, teach her how to, uh, you know, uh, eat 
best, right? Uh, and how to just maintain, how to maintain her organ functions by herself. So what was the benefit of it? The side benefit? Well, number one, she came to us because she, her blood sugar was going out of, out of control, even with medications and, and, and injections. So we helped her body heal itself so that she no longer was a diabetic. The side benefit she experienced, more energy, weight loss, mental acuity. She can think clearer, less pain, vibrant. Those are what I call side benefits. Now again, but those side benefits, right, require a lot of discipline. That's why it's difficult. So the can you see now why I said up here, 80% of population choose temporary results? Because if 80% of the population chose long lasting results, the pharmaceutical companies would go bankrupt. They would not be showing gains, profit after year, right? You know, because that's the reason why I'm saying 80% of the population is temporary, right? But let's not go down that rabbit hole. So for you, what I want you to pay attention to is, is, is really, you got to make sure you ask what solution are you looking for? That's the key thing, because that will either guide you down this pathway or this pathway, right? So if you're going down, if you're going to, if you're, if you're going to go down the temporary delete some of this stuff. If you're going to go down temporary, let's say temporary results is what you want, then you can go to any physician actually, because all physicians are trained to prescribe medication. That's what they learn in medical school, right? Um, actually, and I'm not knocking physician. I love physicians. My older sister is a physician. My brother-in-law is a physician. My best friends are physicians. My friends are physicians. I love physicians. This is not a knock. Okay. But even if temporary, you can go to, like I'm an acupuncturist. And I will tell you, not all acupuncturists are focused on long lasting results. So you can, if you're only looking for temporary results, then you go to these physician, acupuncturists, chiropractors, even holistic practitioners. Just because they're holistic does not mean they provide long lasting results. Practitioner, right? You go to these ones that provide temporary, and they're usually what's usually what's going to happen at these offices. I can tell you what's going to happen at these offices. Treatments are short term. They're quick. Oh, you get one treatment, two treatments, three treatments, and then you're done. Your symptom goes away, then you're done. That's what's going to happen. But if you're wanting long lasting results, guess what? You can move these over here. There are physicians who are focused on long lasting results. They have humility and they realize t medication is only temporary. We can use medication temporarily t to normalize. So let, let's say in di diabetes, the number one thing for diabetes is to is not to drop the blood sugar. If you want to reverse your diabetes, you need to you pay attention to take some notes here. If you want to reverse your diabetes, the first step is not to drop your blood sugar. Th that sounds counterintuitive, right? Again, if you drop your blood sugar, which is the temporary, these are the temporary, that's the temporary temporary results is dropping your blood sugar drop sugar permanent results long lasting results oops you decrease fluctuation that's for diabetes so you can see depending on the solution that you want the treatment will be different the treatment for for this is diabetes this is a great example let me stay on this so if you want to go treat to you have diabetes you want and you say ah, i just want temporary results I'm okay with temporary results, okay? Then you go to your practitioner and the first thing they're gonna do is drop your blood sugar through medications. And they'll drop it really fast or they'll give you insulin, inject it and, and it's, right? But if you want long lasting results, you may still get medication, but the focus is on decreasing fluctuation, not dropping your blood sugar, okay? So you see the difference? Right, so I won't go into too, too much detail that way. I'll do another uh, podcast on reversing di uh, type two diabetes. But again, if if you want long, long lasting results, you go to a practitioner that focuses on long lasting results. Now, their treatments will be longer. It'll be six months to twelve months. These will just be the the short term, just one or two weeks, or maybe a month, and that's it. Those are short term results, right? 
temporary results. But if you want to fix your problem, you want to have long lasting results and restore your organ function and restore your body's ability to heal itself, the treatments are going to take longer, right? So that's the difference. So again, these are guidelines that help you to, to determine if the practitioner you're working for right now, are they really focused on temporary results or long lasting results, right? Temporary results, symptom based. All your symptoms gone, you're good. Long lasting results. Hey, can your body do this by itself? Can your body heal it by itself? Can, we, can your body manage your blood sugar without medications, without injections, without supplements, without acupuncture? See, just because I'm an acupuncturist doesn't mean, remember, you see, just because someone's an acupuncturist doesn't mean they focus on long lasting results. In our clinic at Achieve Integrative Health, we focus on long lasting results. Our definition is we're going to retrain your body so that your body starts to heal itself. Once your body starts to heal itself, then we start back. We start removing us. We do not want for you to be dependent on us. So if you're dependent upon your chiropractor, acupuncturist, uh, hypnotherapist in order to survive, they're doing temporary results. They're not doing long lasting results. And that's so again, just want to clarify that so you understand, because if you focus, if you do treatments on, let's say you, you want long lasting results, but you keep on doing treatments that are focused on temporary results, you're wasting your time, you're wasting your money, and you're actually wasting your health. So get clear, I'm gonna end this with, get clear as to what solution you're looking for. That is the most important question you need to ask, and that will help you determine what provider to look for. All right, guys, if you haven't subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button for more uh, of these restorative longevity tips and information. That's what this podcast is focused on. It's giving it to you real, unfiltered, not, you know, I would say transparent. Probably the best word to say transparent. So I'll see you at the next episode.